Ladies and gentlemen, please stand for the national anthem. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome valedictorian and salute to Torian. Four years, four years of football games, exams, homework, dances, four years preparing for the real world, preparing for adulthood, preparing for the rest of our lives, four years imagining our walk across the stage to accept a diploma that signals the beginning of the next chapter in our lives. I've imagined graduation countless times since I entered elementary school. I've imagined my childhood friends and I smiling at each other as we await our names to be called. I've imagined hearing our principal congratulate us on all our accomplishments. I've imagined my family cheering for me as I shake hands with my administration and thank them for everything they've done. I've imagined giving my valedictorian speech, of standing before my peers and yelling, we did it. Instead, I'm speaking into a camera. I haven't seen the majority of my senior class in the last two months and will likely never see some of them ever again. My walk across the stage became a drive through my high school's parking lot. Somehow the end of high school snuck up on us without so much as a goodbye. During my junior year, we read the poem, The Hollow Men by T.S. Eliot. Its haunting conclusion has stuck with me ever since. This is the way the world ends, not with a bang, but with a whimper. For four years, we as seniors have been preparing for our entire lives to change in May of 2020. Whether that means going to college, joining the workforce, or entering the military, etc. Instead, our entire lives changed in March of 2020, two months earlier than expected. Two months that should have been filled with picking out a prom dress, planning a senior prank, basking in the imminent end of our adolescence became a scramble to hit the pause button on an already accelerating public health crisis. With no legitimate plan for testing, diagnosis, and containment for a disease we had received ample warning for, all of society was thrown into limbo, awaiting a signal to indicate a return to normal life that never came. In these uncertain times when children are out of school, the economy is slipping, and people are fighting just to stay afloat, I look to the solidarity of my community. If there is one thing I have learned from my time in high school, it's that supporting your fellow person, leaning on one another and sticking together is essential in navigating crises. When I see people wearing masks in the grocery store, trying to stay six feet apart on the sidewalk, celebrating friends' birthdays while staying in their own cars, I know that there is hope. I know that people are good and are willing to make personal sacrifices for the betterment of society as a whole. I'm as thankful for the lessons I learned outside of the classroom as I am for those learned inside. I wasn't simply taught that the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell or that Swedish interference was essential in the breakup of the Holy Roman Empire. I developed deep personal relationships, influenced social change, and was imbued with concepts of compassion and respect that I carry with me to this day. I finally understand what it means to be a part of a community. My favorite memories from high school are those that see all of us coming together and participating in something bigger than ourselves. 
whether that means yelling horns down at the state soccer championship, claiming seniors on top when we were cheated out of our powder puff football game, or taking part in walkouts protesting gun violence. There is strength in numbers. Now more than ever, it is imperative that we understand the gravity of the threat our society is facing, recognize the privileges and disadvantages various groups face, and proceed accordingly in moving forward to combat this pandemic. This disease is not the great equalizer. It is not itself discriminatory. It simply amplifies pre-existing human divides. Upon lamenting the loss of graduation, prom, and a last chance to experience the joy of childhood, I am also able to very clearly recognize the privileges I wield in even being able to graduate high school, live with my family, look forward to college. My mother grew up in Iran. When she was my age, the country was at war. She listened as bombs fell on her neighbors, a constant reminder that she might be next. She would go on to experience the Iranian revolution and endure its subsequent cultural overhaul. My mom has taught me that situations arise that you can't control. Problems that you never could have predicted come barreling at you full speed. In these instances, she taught me that it is not about the complication, but about how you respond to it. While higher authorities may have utterly failed us in their response, I admire my high school's crusade to make their seniors' last months as special and memorable as possible. From picking up our caps and gowns through a sea of screaming teachers or being handed our diplomas using a decorated pizza serving tool, there have been many lovely quirks that have added to our unconventional experience as seniors. A development that is near and dear to my heart is the use of the Lakeside campus as a meeting spot for students. The parking lot and track are spacious enough to allow for small groups of people to meet six feet apart and catch up, raise each other's spirits, simply enjoy one another's company. In the last two months of my high school career, this campus has given me a gift, connecting me with my community. My friends and I have met up many times to reminisce on our past adventures and appreciate the time we were able to spend together during this formative period in our lives. In this small way, Lakeside hasn't let go of us quite yet, allowing us moments to live once again in teenage innocence. I was always excited to graduate in the year 2020. The aesthetic nature of the numbers 2020 paired with the promise of perfect vision constantly registered with me as distinctive. Now, as I live through the reality of a senior year in 2020, the experience is certainly unexpected. It has been a path of highs and lows that have ultimately guided us on to the rest of our lives with very clear lessons learned. Nothing is certain. Life is not to be taken for granted. Change happens and we must be ready to respond to it head on. We are ready to face a new day. As we stand at the beginning of a new decade, we must not allow our unique experience to be for naught. We are the future, set on learning from the mistakes of the past and adapting to the ever-changing present. Congrats and good luck, class of 2020. Virtually the best class ever. We did it. Greetings and congratulations to every one of you here today. For those of you who do not know me, my name is Jero Chen, and I'm honored to be speaking to you all. I hope everyone is celebrating because we did it. We finally made it through the grueling four years of high school and what a trip it has been. Along our journey, we've gone through and experienced numerous trends, including, but certainly not limited to, the floss, the In My Feelings Challenge, Yanny versus Laurel, the Bottle Cap Challenge, and TikTok. But with these good memories, we, unfortunately, face some bad times as well, having to face worsening climate change, the current presidency, global terrorism, trade wars of the world, and a little thing called COVID-19. This class has been through a lot, but each time when the dust has settled, all I see around me are strong, intelligent, thoughtful faces ready to face any challenge head on. A time each of these qualities was exemplified was on April 20th, 2018. Now many of you may recognize that day for a slightly different reason. Yes, I know it is 420, but that was the day of our national walkout in protest of the school shootings around the country. As I stood in solidarity amongst my fellow students, all I saw were people I go to school with every day fighting to make a change against an issue they saw sweeping across our nation. And that gave me hope. If local high school students can make such a stand, what could possibly stop them from changing the world? 
This is a belief I want each of you to take home as I firmly believe the capabilities are within every one of you to make any change in the world. To put this world altering declaration into perspective, our class has already done tremendous things. From giving nationally presented TED Talks to state recognized theater shows, our class has accomplished so much already. Heck, we even made it to the soccer state championship last year. But these achievements are just the beginning. As we step forward into the next chapter of our lives, remember that every one of you are on the cusp of greatness. Only you have the capabilities to succeed and fail, and the possibilities for both are in your grasp. And to the people who may doubt these words, questioning their individual capabilities, remember the wise words of Theodore Roosevelt. Believe you can, and you're halfway there. And finally, always remember it is you who have come this far. It is you who have worked for everything you've accomplished, and it is you who are here to celebrate. Thank you. Welcome to our graduating seniors, families, teachers, and esteemed guests. The time has finally arrived. Graduation night for the class of 2020. Tonight we gather to take part of a solemn, age-old tradition that stems back to 12th century Europe. The word graduate is actually based on a Latin word, gratis, which means step. Tonight, each of you will step away from what you've known for 12 years. In that same moment, you will step into your career to continue your education and enter whatever lies ahead. This gratis is a pivotal one, and I'd like to take a moment to reflect on what you carry with you as a Lakeside graduate. Last week, I saw an old story on social media about someone who spilled their cup of coffee. When asked why, they angrily retorted, because someone bumped them. However, the story continues to make the point that coffee was spilled because coffee was in the cup. Not tea, not milk, but coffee. The good and the bad will happen. What we carry inside, who we are as people, profoundly impacts how we will respond to what happens to us and ultimately what spills out of us into this world when life is hard. The class of 2020 undoubtedly has had its share of bad times, and I have no illusion that those bad times are only limited to the devastating and still unfolding consequences of COVID-19. Still, here you are on graduation night with your family and friends, a diploma in your hand, readying yourself to step into your future. An opportunity that, as Hannah and the events of this year so aptly remind us, is a privilege. So what's in your cup? And what spills out when you hit hard times? I've spent some time finding the answers to those questions by getting to know many of you, talking to your teachers and researching what the members of the class of 2020 carry. You carry perseverance and determination. I have stories of some of you sending in assignments from jobs you suddenly had to acquire or putting the Herculean effort to submit exams to be here tonight, literally at the final hour, in the midst of a global pandemic. You carry a drive for excellence. Before we closed, I had the opportunity to watch your big hearts as you gave athletics, fine arts, and extracurricular events your all, and heard stories from your coaches and mentors of your successes in competitions at the local, county and state levels. You carry the Viking commitment to be lifelong learners. In achieving this milestone, you are now fully prepared to continue your learning in your careers and future educational pursuits. It has been exciting to see so many of your names who thought graduation wouldn't be possible this year given all the barriers this virus presented. Being part of Academic Signing Day and hearing tales of successful academic competitions further underscored for me the academic achievement of this class. Achievement that I will highlight in a moment in the formal academic summary of this class. You carry compassion and a willingness to use your power to advocate for social change. I certainly hear that commitment when Jared describes Lakeside's response to guns violence. I witnessed it myself these past months when Lakeside's Latino organization, the Hope Club, jumped into action with emergency fundraising and work together with the Lakeside Foundation to respond to COVID-19. Together, they provided urgently needed food and basic assistance 
to cover over a hundred of our lakeside families. This pandemic took many things from your senior year. It's my hope that you stay cognizant to also what it gave. I hope it filled your cup with a deepened awareness of the realities our communities face as health disparities and social injustice are brought into sharp focus. I hope it filled your cup with both the motivation and commitment to now utilize your education, your voice, your vote, and the best of who you are to address what is broken. So the solidarity that we feel in these moments persists. I hope it filled your cup with the same swell of Viking pride that your families, teachers, and mentors feel when we reflect on you and what the class of 2020 carries forward to shape your story. The challenge I want to leave with you tonight is simple. When the hardness of life bumps you, disappoints you, and at times even brings you to your knees, make sure what spills out of your cup into this world is something good. The class of 2020 has remarkable legacy. One you should be proud of and inspired by. What you do with that legacy and what you leave behind, that is up to you. As I present the following academic summary of this class, I want to underscore that none of this would be possible if Lakeside's families hadn't stood up behind each and every graduate. You had to suddenly pivot from planning what to do with an empty nest and trying to prepare them for independence by letting go of your academic parenting role to suddenly embracing the role of a teacher and homeschooling, a role, a role not unlike the one that you had in their early years of school. You had to scramble to get and use electronics. You had to welcome Verge and Zoom classrooms into what used to be your living rooms. You had to dig deep to soothe and buoy your students' disappointments while simultaneously navigating your own. Never in my 28 years of education has this support of a student's family been more urgently needed than in these past few months. You've done a tremendous job, and for that, the Lakeside administration, teachers, and faculty are deeply appreciative. The ways in which students, families, teachers, administrators, and our community has forged together in this crisis has been an inspiration to witness and should fill all of our cups with Viking pride. Now, on behalf of the faculty, staff, and administration of Lakeside High School, I am pleased to present the academic summary of Lakeside High School Class of 2020. The class consists of 456 graduates and has accomplished the following academically. 111 graduates are graduating with a 4.0 GPA or higher. 62% of our graduates are eligible for the HOPE Scholarship. 53% will attend a two or four year college or university. One cadet has already made a military career commitment. 11,596,354 scholarship dollars were awarded to the class of 2020. And we have 115 seniors, that's 25% of our graduating class, that are eligible for the Zell Miller Scholarship with a 3.7 or higher HOPE GPA. At this time, please join me in welcoming our superintendent of DeKalb County School District, Mrs. Ramona Tyson, to certify the academic summary of this class of 2020. As the superintendent of DeKalb County Schools, I hereby certify that all members present for the class of 2020 have fulfilled the requirements established by the DeKalb County Board of Education and are therefore eligible to receive their diplomas. Please welcome from the DeKalb County School District Board of Education, Ms. Allison Gewertz. Hello, Lakeside Class of 2020. This is a very special day. It's momentous for all of you, but it's also personally significant for me. Two years ago, I met with my Board of Education predecessor, Jim McMahon, and asked him if he was going to run for another term on the school board. I told him I was thinking of running for public office, but wouldn't run against him. 
he told me he hadn't decided whether to run or not, but he would talk to his family and figure it out. A couple of months later, he told me he was not planning to run. His family wanted him back. He encouraged me to run for his seat and said he would support me. However, there was one condition. He wanted to give his daughter, Nan, her diploma in May of 2020. I agreed, imagining Jimmy Mack on the big stage at the Georgia World Congress Center, hugging his daughter as she became a Lakeside High School graduate. Unfortunately, we are not at the Georgia World Congress Center, and sadly, Jim, aka Jimmy Mack, is not physically with us today. However, I can assure you he is with us in spirit. And right now, he's not only sending Nan a huge congratulatory hug, he's hugging the entire Lakeside class of 2020. He is so proud of you. When I think both about Nan and the class of 2020, I'm overcome with admiration. You all are so resilient. I'd like to quote Elizabeth Edwards, who was a very resilient public figure and cancer survivor. She said, resilience is accepting your new reality, even if it is less good than the one you had before. You can fight it, you can do nothing but scream about what you've lost, or you can accept it and try to put together something that's good. Class of 2020, you have put together something that's good. You are showing us all what resilience looks like. Those of us who've experienced the traditional rites of passage at the end of a K-12 journey, prom, senior day, in-person graduation, have mourned for what you've lost. But what's interesting is that some of us have struggled with your loss more than you have. You've not wallowed in pity, you've not given up, and you've not stopped moving forward. I saw your virtual senior week, your parades, your videos, and your drive-through diploma pickup. You've shown us all what accepting our new reality looks like. As you go into the world, Lakeside High School Class of 2020, please keep showing us. Keep teaching us about resilience. And congratulations to all of you. On the basis of your certification, I accept your recommendation. The academic achievement of this class meets the course requirements as established by Advanced Ed, the Georgia Board of Education, the Georgia Accrediting Commission, and the DeKalb County Board of Education. As a representative of the DeKalb County Board of Education, I authorize the presentation of diplomas and certificates to the class of 2020 of Lakeside High School. Congratulations. Jade Brianna Aaron. Abagamal Yahya Abajobir. Mikita Solomon Abebe. Joshua Samuel Abend. Alessandra Aguilar. Rodrigo Aguilar Hernandez. Roman Ahrioria Aguilar Rodriguez. Jason Aguirre Leon. Tyra Adabapu Akiolo. Anna Catherine Albright. Melanie Alcantar Garcia. Theatric Marcel Alexander Jr. Aaron Vivian Allen. Josefa Daniela Almaza. Christopher James Alvarez Hernandez. Chrissy Alejandra Alvarez Rampali. Naja Yum Alwakil. Jalen DeAndre Anderson. Lauren Elizabeth Anderson. Solomon Michonne Andrews. 
Kyla Chahira Arias. Jared Michael Erigetti. Haley Christian Arrington. Maria Alicia Arroyo. Samuel Kelly Asher. Aaron Elizabeth Austin. Mary Ann Angel Avendano. Fearless Yaharid Aviles. Lizbeth Carolina Ayala Requeño. Lena Hannah Ayu. Hermela Baruch Azanyu. Jennifer Rebecca Boxa. Lucy Pierce Behrman. Taibu Balde. Hannah June Baniasa. Charlotte Consuelo Barrios. Jarahai Barry. Evren Basaran. Bean Ansel Bomstark. Jesus Emmanuel Bautista Castellanos. Sydney Faith Bopier. Lulawit Mesfew Belichu. Catherine Grace Bell. Gerald Allen Bell. Joseph Darnell Bell. Cora May Benami. Taylor Francis Bennett. Camille Alizi Dina Boutuel. Maron Bayonet. Franzal Bandari. Connor James Bialy. Sarah Ruth Bishop. Rachel Grace Blackmore. Devana Antonia Blue. Brittany Ocosio Agyapa Bochi. Stefan Christopher Boddington. Claire Maria Borrego Ricapa. Stephen Isaac Bostic Hidalgo. Kyrie Xavier Bowen. John Achilles Bauzard. Sontai Blue Ari Boyd. Hope Elizabeth Bradley. Chase Jeremy Broman. Cambrian De Jarvis Brown. Lance Miles Preston Brown. Angeles Alejandro Bullion Veraza. Tyler Mikhail Bush. Asia Nikia Butler. Cameron Darnell Butler. Madison Milan Bird. 
Amaryllis cano nava. Catherine Ileri Hope Stucky Carlton. Nicholas Joseph Carmen. Catherine Jane Carr. Kevin Karim Carranza. Micah Joseph Carrier. Nicholas Clay Carson. Gabriel DeLeon Cartwright. Abraham Castillo. Jose Antonio Seja Garnica. Maria Esperanza Chacon Escobar. Giselle Chamorro Largo. Paula Andrea Chavez Vargas. Jared Ying Xing Chin. Sophia Elisa Cheruby. Eric Youngmin Cho. Jeremy Ali Clark Jr. Emily Fionel Clausen. Antonio Christopher Clay. Levi Awan Clown. Grace Barksdale Klaus. Nalia Marie Cohen. Alexis Colato. Yareli Contino Delgado. Talia Naomi Coopersmith. Madison Ann Cora. Stephanie Correa. Michelle Cortez Pinzon. Sean Patrick Costin. Hollis Risley Cox. Jada Brianna Crum. Ariana Bernal Cruz. Lelia Marner Cryer. Tristan Craig Culbreth. Alexander Benjamin Kunar. Amin Aziz Damerji. Joseph Tapia D'Antonio. Jason Michael Darby. Lennox Cole Christler Davis. Micaiah Josephine Davis. Summer Malia Davis. Akash Devkata. Sydney Perry DeWoody. Maria Fernanda Diaz Sanchez. Kinsey Kuo Lam Dang Do. Jamia Kutura Dorsey. Sophie Helen DuPont. Rachel Viola Marie Dunbar. Ryan Thomas Dunbar. Terrell Nicholas Dunbar. 
Dorian Dewan Edi. Alice Edan Decker Earwood. Daniel J. Edwards. Grace Elizabeth Ellett. Ruby Louise Elliott. Lauren Olivia Epps. Emma Bess Epps Long. Arian Isaiah Irby. Lydia Caitlin Ahrens. Jasmine Espidola. Luis Angel Espinosa. Cami Rukia Evans. Mary Catherine Evans. Quentin James Evans. Isaac Lindbergh Feldstein. Winter Essence Ferracho. Brooklyn Dre Ferguson. Jesus Fernandez. Kevin Roberto Fernandez. Kelsey Nicole Fitz. Lily Alexandra Fletcher. Stephanie Janeth Flores Zavala. Fiona Leslie Forst. Aiden Allen Forbes. Christian John Forbes. Siandro Monier Fortenberry. Elfinish Millicent Fortune. Julia Marie Frank. Wyatt Daniel Franco Lopez. Matthew Robert Franklin. Casey Nicole Rose Friedlander. Connor Kathleen Gallagher. Jensen's Ramsey Gayarzo Jimenez. Yesman Dual Gamez Cruz. Anna Catherine Garcia. Carlos Hernan Garcia. Jonathan Garcia. Luciana Garcia. Ashley Michelle Garcia Ramos. Nancy Yesenia Garcia Rodriguez. Zion DeAnthony Gartrell. Cynthia Bernice Garza Esparza. Ellen Owetehagen Gabriel Hannes. Ratika Himant Kehani. Lauren Aria Gibbons. Taylor Lynn Gilliam. Samuel Dean Ginsburg. Sean Robert Gleason. Alan Jacob Goffman. Jacob Alexander Gosselin. 
Reagan Ember Green. Morgan Alyssa Grego. Ethan Michael Gregory. Noah Zachary Armenia Grosh. Eduardo Daniel Guillen. Brian Gutierrez Resendez. Joshua Jeremy Gutierrez Gonzalez. Pablo Gutierrez Gonzalez. Ella Cristina Guzman. Lydia Hagios. Elizabeth Ivy Haight. Dion Malik Hayes. Isabel Grace Hebert. Benjamin Marcus Hecker. Joseph Michael Hellenbrook. Annette Heredia. Diego Jafet Hernandez Aguilar. Gregorio Hernandez Aragon. Denise Hernandez Badillo. Joanna Elizabeth Herrera. Vivian Augusta Higgins. Colin Alexander Hill. Jack Hensley Hobbs. Jude Gannon Hoffer. Alina Jane Holly. Kayla Shaniel Holmes. Joshua Reed Horvath. Connor William Howard. Emma Elizabeth Hudson. Thomas Kane Buck Hunt. Milka Dahiana Hus Antunez. Mariana David Hutchison. Luis Enrique Ignacio Diaz. Brandon Lawrence Jackson. Delicia John A. Jackson. Jimmy Lee Jackson III. Michelle Jackson. Jotary Courtney James. Miles Elijah James. Christine Lee Jarman. Aiden Keir Gunn Jarvis. Yai Javier Jester. Brianna Ashanti Jonakin. Aurika Marie Johnson. Joyce Jamel Danielle Johnson. Azaria Shahar Jones. Jalen Tajay Joseph. Gabriela De Jesus Juarez Ramirez. Carson Matthew Just. Benedicte Salima Colonda. 
Melate Haile Kasi. Abram Degim Kosai. Akriti Darshani KC. Nathaniel Alton Kennedy. Philip Theodore Kirsch. Matthew Vaughn Kessler. Sierra Kim. Amen Gebrahidim Kiros. Kalina Kiros. Carson Gray Kleider. Ahmet Emir Korkmaz Xavier Christoph Kretzinger Walters Gabrielle Alice Kroger Rith Mambu Kunga Jessica Than Lach Aiden Thomas Lamberti. Austin Jack Lanier. Elisa Carolina Lara. Thomas Henry Lazar Waldman. Trung Tian Li. Alexa Mariana Lee. Cassandra Ray Lee. Alexis Christine Lafave. Harrison Izell Leff. Vicky Francois Valencourt Lepine. Anastash Kirka Nicole Lewis Joshua Christopher Lewis Zihao Lee Claire Sarah Lin Jing Hui Christopher Lin John Timilalua Lewis Ogbo. Jackson Scott Lucas. Marco Sibihi Macaron. Sarah Magalion Dorantes. Afnan Mohammed Yor Mahmud. Charles Eric Maki Aiden Matthew Monella Ian Thomas Mansker Tiana Carmel Manuel Luke Barrett Marchison Claudia Vano Marino Augusta Daly Martin Salvador Martinez Abigail Martinez Rojas Emily Del Carmen Martinez Rodriguez Simran Masi Andrew Ethan Mohan Georgina Charlotte Malden Juliet Genevieve Malden Eric Imfonabasi Maurice 
Clara Elizabeth McCauley. Andrew Martin McBride. Brandon Dimitri McCarver. Alicia Jade McCloudy. William Lucas McConaughey. Jacob Ames McGinnis. Nancy Ann McMahon. Paige Dawson Meisner. Heidi Lisbeth Mejia. Micaias Berhanu McConan. Sesson Berhane Meleas. Kelvin Antonio Mercado Cruz. Harper Darius Messer. Edwin Oliver Meyer. Michael Meza Quahutencos. Jeremy Bennett Mezoff. Blake Jackson Mosichi. Juliana Heidi Milani. Brooke Day Mills. Sydney Noel Mills. Dallas Janae Mitchell. Michaela Deshaun Mitchell. Valentivia Elijah Mitchell. Bruno Santiago Molina Ulloa. Michael Truett Monteith. Brian Philip Moore III. Elwood Sheldon Moore. Jacob Price Moore. Simone Raylin Moore. Alondra Marie Mora Torres. Tamara Morales Navarro. Gabriel Moreno Corridor. Decatur Ward Morse. Karen Thomas Moulton. Mugala Waweru Mugaisi. Taha Awais Muhidin. Megan Jikong Murphy. Jordan Anise Mura. Mason Buchanan Myler. Yesenia Nataras Alonso. Marianella Navaretti Almanza. Julissa Navarro Soto. Daniel Anderson Newmeyer. Amy Fuang Nguyen. Eric Nino Navarrete. Nathaniel Julian Noisin. Isabella Cristina Nunez. William Thomas Oberholzer. Sam Obhai. Eduardo Ochoa Garcia. 
Mohammed Abdelkadir Omar. Muna Abdelkadir Omar. Kagan Elise Ortland. Abhai Joseph Osores. Sophia Rose Page. Thomas Lane Parker. Zabria Marnaja Parker Long. Akash S. Patel. Nikita H. Patel. Jesus Alejandro Pelais. Flavius Constantin Panescu. Spencer Gray Pennington. Destiny Vera Perez. Luis Orlando Perez Flores. Naomi Arleth Piedro. Jeffrey Connor Pierce. Justin Bentley Pierre. Helen Olivia Polinski. Pamela Portia Martinez. Grant Louis Prusik. James Edward Purvis III. Elizabeth Joel Quick. Jason Andres Quiros. Angelo Monsanto Reagan. Alicio Christopher Raghi. Emily Ramirez Maris. Jandri Daniela Ramos Gallardo. Jasmine Simone Redu. Ruby Grace Reich. Arena Allen Reed Martin. Noah Charon Ryder. Nicholas Emmanuel Reynolds. Quinn Carol Reynolds. Christian Ryan Richards. Noah Ali Ritchie. Anne Elizabeth Richmond. Patrick Monroy Richmond. Christopher Haas Rigby. James Murray Riley. Elandra Rios Nino. Jaime Alexander Robertson. Kylie Brianne Robinson. Greta Rojas Ulloa. Ricardo Obed Rosales Maldonado. Derek Alexander Rose. Victoria Ruiz. Jennifer Jasmine Ruiz Sanchez. Kiona Alora Ross. Adam Joseph Sanfratello. Alan Gonzalo Sanchez Vega. 
Christina Marlowe Sanders. Jumara Sandoval. Issa Shimsu Sani. Jesus Manuel Santana Mejias. Sarah Michelle Santos. Shumanto Sanyo. Patty Sanyang. Fama Fanyang Sar. Kevin Sasso Morera. Guadalupe Maria Saucedo Flores. Juan Alberto Saucedo Torres. Emma Greer Schimmelman. Madeline Jane Schaefer. Sophia Shaw. Anjali Louise Sharma. Vidhura Malith Silva. Jacob Keith Simon. Ivan Simon Gervasio. Harris Sawyer Simpson. Javon Alexander Sims. Lucy Natalia Skelton. Brenton Gregory Smith. Makaya Yvonne Smith. Princess Deshaun Andrea Smith. Luis Alexander Solizano Vazquez. Yeli Amy Samira Sora. Alexandra Beth Spivak. Robert Thomas Steele. Natalie Ann Stemble. Kyle Parker Swift. Zaren Tasnin Taniza. Matthew Connor Tate. Abigail Ann Taylor. Tanisha Nicole Taylor. Kalaya Naji Tishishama. Dallas Cole T. Michael Christian Thomas II. Hayden Nan Tu Nguyen. Josiah Dimitris Towns. Nicholas Phi Tran. Devon Isaac Treor. John Francis Trinellis. Gabriel Constantine Sismanakis. Stephanie Marie Turner. Alexia Francesca Tyron. Tavon Tiger Utley. Carla Liseth Valente. Hayden Imani Van de Cruz Lemon. Sarah Elizabeth Van Horn. Abigail Lee Van Pelt. 
Virginia Adams Van Pelt. Carlo Salzano Vani. Montserrat Vasquez Mendez. Nicholas Fotios Vastakis. Maria Alejandra Velez Blandin. Alan Villanueva. Andrea Jovita Villanueva. Marlis Joselle Vincent. William Cade Walden. Joe Rutland Walker. Bailey Marie Walton. Aiden Lee Whitcomb. Iris Elizabeth Wickham. Michael Thomas Whiter. Mina Starr Willett. Essence Mion Williams. Samuel Edward Williams. Trinity Tremaine Williams. Sarah June Willis. Ryan Elise Wilson. Joel Warren Charles Withy. Eric Liam Wolstenholm. Jordan Samuel Woodhouse. Nuri Suseli Zikara Alonzo. John Connolly Zides. Natalie Ibarra. Kedist Fetene Yeminyu. Maya Jakari Young. Jenny Jai Ja. Xing Zhang. Emily Zhao. Andres Miguel Zumaran. Jonah Zvazvinawako. Traditionally, the gesture of moving the tassel from one side of the cap to the other symbolizes the individual's transition from candidate to graduate. However, the symbolism of this act is much more profound as it represents the culmination of a myriad of events, decisions, and accomplishments bringing you to this point in your life. It represents the first step into a new journey and chapter of your life, where you will continue to add to what you carry inside of you. Class of 2020, please stand. Raise your hand to your tassel and turn your tassel from right to left. Congratulations.